Hey, what's up, what's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. As you can see by the title of this video, today I'll be talking about Class N, which is by far the most interactive app I have found so far. If you are an independent teacher, a private tutor, a university, or local school looking for an interactive online platform, then look no further. As you know, COVID-19 has changed a lot of things in the world and more people were forced to move into the online world. When I was teaching online, I enjoyed that the lessons were provided for free, but I also most of the time wish that I taught my own lessons, things that I was interested in. And the one thing I really love doing is creating my own cartoon character. If you carry on watching this video, you'll see that my cartoon character in the video, in the lesson demonstration, I'm literally wearing the exact outfit. And Klassen is the only app I know online that gives me that option to include my cartoon character in my lessons. If you're wondering now, what is Balissa talking about? What is Class N? Stay tuned, watch the whole video. By the end of this video, you will definitely know what Class N is and you will want to get Class N, I promise you. Let's face it guys, Zoom and Skype were never meant to be used for online teaching. This app was literally designed for that. It's also one of the few apps that work really, really well on cell phones. Not only well on cell phones, but it just works well worldwide. As you know, I live in South Korea, but in the demonstration video that I'm about to show you, both my students were actually in South Africa when we were doing this lesson and the connection was perfect regardless of literally our distance apart. So that is a plus for me. Anyways, I hope you enjoy the video and watch till the end because I have a little surprise for you. Hello, Jordan. Hello, Sandra. Hi. So I'm quickly going to show you a video. With this option, I can share my screen with my students and I think it is really convenient. As you can see, I'm on YouTube showing them a video. These are the taste, my taste best can be. The next option, I can ask all my students to type at the same time what they've heard in the video. Type anything you, you heard. Oh, wait. My students cannot type or draw anything unless I authorize them, which I do that by giving them a crown. Okay, sweet, Jordan. This is an option that I use to upload a lesson that I've already created. What is today's topic? Hmm. Okay. Just read. I also enjoy Today's using topic. the red marker because both me and the students can Please see. Please try some, yeah. Or, do you want some more? So what I'm going to do now is use a machine slot. So if you see your name, you have to read. I love the okay, machine really? slot because it's a nice way to select which number student one, gets to student. read. Read number one. It's salty. Good. Number two. <laughs> Jordan again. It's sour. Good. Number three, Sandra. It's spicy. It's spicy. Good. Both did a good job. So let me give you a trophy. A trophy is used to reward students and you can see the big smiles on their faces. Okay, let's move to this one. What do you see here? Yeah, what's this? If you know the answer, raise your hand. This is also a fun feature where you can see which student raised their let's hand see. first. Sandra first. Yes. Sweet. So what we're going to do now, I'm going to give you the option, uh, both of you don't start, but you have to move the sweet things to the sweet box and the sour things to the sour box. Which one is the move one? As you can see, my student it's didn't know which one, one is the move option. option and so I had to use a screenshot and show her which Mission. one was the move button and she got it right immediately. So this is also a very Take helpful a tool. I got it. Yeah. Cool. Let's go to the next one quickly. Ready? As you can see, when I set the timer, I can also play the same song that I'm uploading, but you can play any other song so that the class is not too quiet and the kids are still entertained. Another thing I enjoyed was that I could see which student was moving which picture and it made it easier for me to reward the right student. So I love the fact that you can see the names. You did good. So this one is salty. Okay, let's move oh, over to the crossword puzzle. We're going to use a responder. The first person to click will answer. So number one, down, you use chili to make your food. 
as you can see there are various options to select students and it makes it fun Your and interesting is two down today's eggs are very this is also helpful to spot out which students are struggling maybe they don't raise their hand a lot when the questions are asked okay salty, salty. okay word search you can also create word searches and as you can see you can see which student is actually highlighting the word you can also drag and drop their cameras this is if you want to create like a board game so it's very interactive and as you can see i've also added a timer again as well as music so that it's not too quiet and the students know how much time they have so let's do let's alternate the first one will be Jordan you have 10 seconds and also upload worksheets and ask students to circle or color in however you choose but it's very fun and they really really enjoyed this as a teacher you can also delete things as you can see the students highlighted chili and cheese and they were not salty so that's also a great option teachers have control of the classroom if you look at the cameras, you'll see the crown keeps on moving from one student to another. This means that when one student is answering, the other student cannot write when it's not their turn to answer. I want us to do an activity. You can also upload activity. various forms of Microsoft except Excel. So like you see here, I've uploaded my PowerPoint, which so, I want them to some. practice. So you ready? They're going to start moving fast. We're going to read together. Flavor. 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 Try. Delicious. Ice. Into. Walk. Sour. Sour. Drink. Spicy. But. Sweet. Good I job. also took this worksheet from a textbook so you can also like I said upload okay, various yeah. forms of worksheets that are very interactive okay, number one okay please raise your hand if you know number one okay Sandra first number one and then Jordan number two Okay, let's move to the next one. Thank you. Drag and drop. There's also a dice that so you can use to play your board games. I used it to select which drag and drop question must be answer answered. Sentences. Uh, raise your hand if you want to do go first. Okay, let's see. Sandra, raise your hand first. Okay, Sandra, please roll the dice. Number one. Okay, please answer number one. Good job. Okay, Jordan, please roll the dice. Roll again. Five. Okay, let's see. This is five. I'm going to hand out small boards, drawing boards. I'm going to give you 20 seconds to draw your favorite food. Each student will have their individual board and I as a teacher can collect and hand out okay, to the okay, board. Let me collect and see. Let's see Jordan. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Chili. Oh, watermelon. Watermelon. And how does watermelon taste like? Is it sweet, sour, spicy, salty? Sweet. Okay, let's look at Sandra's picture. Chips. Okay, chips. Good. How do chips taste like, Sandra? Sweet, spicy, salty. 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 So number one, 
Look at the picture. Okay. Ready? Go. There's also a multiple choice option that students can just click on okay. their screens and it's easy for the teacher to correct. see who got it wrong and who got it right. Hey. Ready? Go. Correct. It's spicy. It tastes like. Correct. It's salty. There's also an option where students can chat or ask questions during the session whether they are authorized or not, which is great. The last option I'm going to talk about is the assignments option where we hand out homework as teachers. Um, so there's homework here, what you have to do today when you eat dinner. Um, I want you to draw a picture of your dinner and then say what it tasted like. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye. If you stayed until this far, that means you enjoyed the video or you also want to know what the surprise is. Another amazing thing that blew my mind about Clausen is the fact that you can have up to 1,000 students in one class. That's insane to even imagine. Even though you won't see all 1,000 students at the same time, the camera will automatically rotate all the students every 30 seconds by default. You can of course change this to a minimum of 10 seconds if you're teaching younger kids or increase it. As you saw in the video guys, the fun ways to interact with students in Classroom are literally endless. And now the surprise, you can actually use this app for free for the first two weeks after signing up. So make sure you follow the link in the description bar below don't forget to like and comment down below what you like the most about class a and if you're going to sign up let me know also down below what convinced you so bad that you wanted to get class in and last but not least please subscribe to my channel i'll see you next time bye